Hey! Oh, he said penis. We did <laughs> Good job. <laughs> what up, In everybody? Death, catharsis is returned to the mm -hmm. world. <laughs> uh, we're, we're back. We're, well, uh, some of we're us are back. back. Yeah. Carrie, unfortunately, is no longer with us. They're, uh, they're dead. They they died, and mm -hmm. their ghost is 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 having some soup, and, mm -hmm. and being ill in their office while they're yep. doing work, and they may or may not be in the chat, which you can't see. You're not allowed. It's illegal. Mhm. Mm yep. Yeah. Her, her ghost is very sick right now, and it's very inconvenient because I didn't know ghosts could get sick. Mhm. Mm have ghostitis. Mhm. Mm oh, I've heard that's terminal. The because. worst form of itis. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we're heckin' we're, uh, Aaron and I, well, mostly me. He's just hanging out watching me play this game. <laughs> <laughs> he suggested we play, uh, I play Soma, uh, and I barely know anything about this game except Aaron told me that it's about a guy named, uh, in, from Toronto. Yep. So, and His name's we're Simon. Just, yeah. If I recall correctly. Simon? Mm hmm. For okay. sure. Mm. But. He's all right. I like him. <laughs> okay. Oh, well, yeah. Anyways, we're going to we're gonna play this game now. Ha! Oh. What do I play on? Should I play in safe? Monsters just are creepy but can't kill you. You don't need to worry about the stealth as you play. Monsters are dangerous can kill you. You need to think and sneak and survive. Yeah, that's just too normal. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Save is kind of the, if you want to walk along and take in story, normal is a, a mix of both. Can't say it's exactly super hard. Mm -hmm. uh, and then I don't, I think there's a hard, but uh, don't worry about that. <laughs> no, 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 no. Reality is what, is that which you, when you stop believing in it, something has happened. Are you okay, Doesn't go away. Uh, I think you're bleeding. Oh, that, that's oh, nothing. Shit. It's just my brain can't stop bleeding from the accident. Oh, my poor brain. Here, take this. She keeps bleeding for forever. No, that, that's yeah. for later, for the scan. That's really bad. It's green. Are you not dead? Ashley, I need to tell you something. Simon, please don't make this weird. No, no, it's not like that. Simon, come on. We've been over this. I know. Who's David Lynch? Oh, Simon. Is there never enough time? <laughs> oh, Simon. One thing I like about this no. game. Is that this is the most uh, like NPCs that uh, fictional games has made mm. in any other one? They're yeah, they're pretty I'm shy a... about making Hi, human Simon models. Garrett? Yeah, that's me. Cool. My name is David Munchy. We spoke earlier. The brain scan. I remember. Are you all right? There's yeah. rebirth. Yeah, rebirth probably beat this one out a little bit. Are we still on for today? Yeah, is that the newest one? That's why I'm calling. Yeah. I wanted okay. to remind you to drink the tracer fluid I sent you. It'll help me capture a better image of the damages. Don't worry, I I, I got it somewhere. Okay, great. Well, see you in a Fantastic. couple of hours then. Okay, see Mr. You soon. Munchy. Mr. Munch. Our He's gonna munch your brains. Um, My name is Mr. Munch. Ooh, what do we got here? Hey Simon, it's Jesse. Hello. You working this weekend or what? I knew there was hey, something you were doing. <laughs> was it this weekend or next? <laughs> Just shoot me a right. mail or something. Love you, Missy Mina. Ha! Damn it. Aww. I wanna break it. I swear, that guy is the memory of a goldfish. Chase is a homie, even it's if he's a stoner. Aww. <laughs> it's a... Uh... So the cool thing about the tracer fluid... Uh-huh. ...is that it, it spawns in random spots in, in this house. So, like, this is actually one of the... It's not the worst parts for speed running, because it can only be in one of, like, I think eight places, if I remember mm -hmm. right. Uh, but it is just randomly selected, so you could run and start checking them on. If you're really unlucky, it'll be the last one you get. Oh, no. Ha! Yo! Okay. Hey Let's go check this computer. Ha, computer. All right. From David Munchie. Uh, I can think... Are we... Are we David? No, David is our doctor. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, thank you again for participating in our research. The scan will be performed at the uh, Pace uh, Laboratories in Toronto. Yeah, uh, but Monsters. since we are, <laughs> but since we are guests, uh, our access is a bit unpredictable. 
I will try to schedule a scan session for Saturday. It will get back to you when uh, confirmed. Sincerely, David Munch. I'm going to go on Do Not Disturb on Discord because that seems like Just a good idea. Just getting pink, Yeah, I got pink. Yeah. All right. New, new prescription from Dr. Aaron Peak. Dear hmm. Mr. Janet. What? Don't worry about it. Okay. <laughs> uh, uh, dear Mr. Jarrett, Jarrett, uh, I'm happy to hear your uh, headaches have become less frequent. Your latest tests show your brain is slowly recovering. Ooh, neat. Uh, but it's still too early to tell how well it will adjust to the damage. The bleeding will continue over the coming months at least, and you will need to come to the hospital a few times to drain the cavity to prevent the blood from building up pressure. Uh, since excessive stress could be fatal, I have, I have written you... Oh, my God. I have written you a prescription for uh, prazosin uh, to help you with your nightmares. Now, please read the instructions and medicate accordingly. I'm going to try to get a lot of rest, and I will see you next week. Fuck, I found out what the goddamn, like, the madness, like, mechanic is of this game. Like, hey, don't get stressed or you'll fucking bleed to death. Oh, Two? I forgot to hit send. Yep. Huh? Uh, Jesse. Oh, who's Jesse? The, gr the Grimoire. That's the guy who just phoned you. He's like, hey, what do uh, you do, Suka? Hey, what's up? He's like, hey, it's Jesse. It's time I forgot to send the email. Since you probably forgot, here's my remo uh, here's me reminding you that I have got uh, that doctor's appointment tomorrow, i.e. I'm not coming into work. Um, this means you need to make sure you're actually on time uh, to open up the store and please unpack the boxes behind the counter. Uh, they are starting to become a workplace hazard. Also, books uh, tend to sell much better if they put on, uh, they're put on sell shelves where people are able to actually see them. Good luck. You'll need it. Simon. Here you go. There you go. Yes, Better sent late it. than never. Better late than never. Okay. Oh. Uh, let's see. Oh. Can't, can't tell what this says. Uh, nope. Something, something. Uh, Motion. It's a pie graph. It's a little Cute doodle little doodle. On it. Okay. I like the doodles. Yeah, just little doodles, pie chart, and graphs. Cool. Doodle is a little figure on the on the desk. Aw. Love uh, mom. Aw. Nothing on the back. Okay. Uh, view text. Oh. Wait. That's for that one, yeah. Oh, get well soon, love mom. Okay. I think that's a helpful thing they put in some of their games because sometimes cursive is really hard for people. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Robin McConnell, meet and greet, book signing. The Grimoire. Grimoire. Wait. Prescription. Uh, okay. Oh, it's prescription for the stuff. Okay. Let's get some light Someone's in here. Coming. Oh, it's terrifying! Ah, How can you even look at me? This is the worst! <laughs> Alright, I gotta... We're gonna brush my teeth. Gotta brush your teeth. Can't have stinky breath. Can't have that stinky breath. Not while they're scanning your brain. Yeah. They'll know you're thinking about your stinky breath. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, just get it all. That's how, that's how then... brain scans work. <laughs> Yep, fucking... All right, there we go. All right. What am I supposed to Where's do? The They've died. Uh, you need to find uh, the tracer fluid. That was the phone call you got while you're in bed. Mm. It's uh, You got to drink it so it can run through your system, and that lets the MRI scan read your brain a little bit easier. Okay. Is there any fluids in here? That's not a fluid. That's my toothpaste. That's some old toothpaste. Yeah, or maybe like a butt cream. Oh, nice butt cream. More Looks butt like cream. <laughs> Could be butt cream though. Hmm. Yeah, it could be in like a drawer, cupboard. I think mine was in the fridge. Oh, it's like randomly placed every time. Yeah, there's like I think eight eight spots. I think it can spawn. Oh, okay. 
it's because it wants you to really explore in this so you can learn what things you can interact with. Mm. Man, I have not been taking care of my plant. Yeah, I mean, this place is kind of a shithole, but I mean, your brain is bleeding all the time. So like, you know, who gives a fuck? That makes sense. What is this? Lighter? Switchblade? Uh, not switchblade, but a pocket knife? Uh, seems like it. At least I got a Swiss Army knife. Switchblades are illegal in Canada, so it couldn't be switchblade. Unless Simon's a fucking criminal. <gasps> oh, I fucking knew it. He's a criminal. Yeah, the weird thing about switchblades, though, is that we're really pedantic about what is and isn't a switchblade. If the button is on the handle of the knife, it's a switchblade and it's illegal. If it's mm -hmm. on the blade of the knife, it's a spring assisted opening knife, which is not a switchblade. What the fuck? Yeah, Are it's you in the oven? I don't think it can spawn in the oven. Darn. And the drawers here. You gotta organize your stuff better, Simon. <laughs> God damn it, Simon, remember where your shit is. Why do you put your fucking really important medical tracer fluid somewhere in your house? God. And you're like, yeah, it'll be fine in, I don't know, my laundry or some shit. I've got a lot of mail here. All right. Hey, we're coming to the subs. Wow, ooh, and biddies. Well, I got some keys. Um. No. We got some subs? Oh, yeah, we did. Uh, so yeah, some resubs. Oh, neat. Oh, thank you for all the resubs, everybody. I have notification. I have the notification things turned off, so. Massive recoil. <laughs> John Hugh is a corrupt cop working in Hong Kong. <laughs> One day, his life is turned upside down as he meets Amber, a mysterious foreigner who's kept prisoner by the Golden Dragon Triad. Get ready to go rogue, for it's time to go against the Triad, the police, and the supernatural forces of the underground. Get ready for... <laughs> massive recoil. <laughs> Ma massive ma recoil, 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 recoil. Uh, downtown accident kills young woman. Uh, Toronto. Uh, yesterday a driver distracted by her children. This is why you shouldn't have children. Ran a red light, uh, causing her to blindside a car in the intersection of Bloor Street. Fucking Bloor Street. And uh, uh, Spadin, uh, Spadina Road. Uh, the mother and her children traveling in a robust SUV were left a bruise, but largely unharmed. The other party was less lucky as the car crashed into the passenger side. Uh, Ashley Hall, 23, sustained devastating damage and suffocated... Oh, she suffocated from blood trapped in her lungs before the ambulance arrived. Her friend and driver, Simon Jarrett, uh, 26 or 5, but with complicated results, believing to uh, believe to uh, leave him with permanent brain damage. Driver of the SUV, whose name uh, has not been released by police, uh, claims it was an accident and practi practically unavoid- Fuck off, lady! You suck! You're a bad, bad lady. What is this? Tissue oh, fluid. Found it. I got it. Mm. Oh, it's gonna it taste like shit. Yeah. It feels like milk, but the taste is like sucking on a penny. <laughs> it tastes <All> right. <laughs> feels like milk, but the taste it's also mi it's just milk. It's milk. <laughs> it's milk. It's clear milk. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Uh, oh, been... horrifying that would be. Yeah. <laughs> what? Transparent <laughs> milk. <laughs> Ugh, no. Ick. Like, okay. it's just weird to think about. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like, it's the that taste yeah, is still the same. Us. Like, the texture and everything is still the same. It's just transparent. And. Yeah, no, no other change. Just transparent yeah. now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that was us, Kobe. Um, we were we were Simon, and we yeah. got we got it. My brain to bleeding forever, and the girl we were trying to be like, yo, you want to kiss maybe? And she's like, oh man, don't make this weird. And you're like, oh no, it's okay. And then she died. And then she fucking died because of a woman with children. This is why you don't need. This is why you shouldn't have children. Just like. <laughs> 
Some mom driving and like she's like it's practically unavoidable. It's like her son in the back seat pulling her hair from mm -hmm. behind, like garroting her with it. She's like, fuck. Turns mm -hmm. to look. That's why she ran it. Fuck that. Ugh. Now they're with anybody, I tell you. Yeah, I remember having my mind fucking blown that even this was happening when uh Yeah. I first played this. There are three people in this train. There sure are. Fucking fictional games, like in all of the Penumbra games, you barely see any other people. Oh shit, Jesse's here. Jesse's. Yeah, let's talk, let's talk to Jesse. Jesse. Hey, Simon. I got your email. Just wanted to wish you good luck and let you know I got you covered. Thanks. I should be able Thanks, to come buddy. to the store after this. Thanks, scan. buddy. I don't sweat it. I got Matt and Chris help me out. Maddie from SNL? Uh, guess you didn't hear. He's coming in full time, working in the comic section. That's Ashley's job. Yeah. Well. You know, she's dead. <laughs> yeah, well, forget it. She's dead, though. Not doing her any favors by leaving an empty spot. Not like she's coming back. Well, well isn't that a leading I line? Find a way to <laughs> the whole, you know, dying thing. <laughs> dying thing? You're the worst support ever. <laughs> what should I say? I'll see you later, Jesse. Don't burn the place down while I'm gone. What a complicated relationship that is right mm -hmm. there. Oh, uh, God. That whole dying thing. Well, like his friend's clearly kind of insensitive, but so is Simon being like, that's Ashley's job. It's like, oh, yeah, well, oh, that was Ashley. It's been at like at least several weeks. And while I am fucking hit by this really hard, I also need my business to function. Yeah. All right, where's the light? Hello? Here we go. Dr. Munchie? Dr. Munch. Where is everyone? I thought this place would be busy. Dr. Munch Crunch. Anybody here? Fresh paint. Oh, there's like benches. fucking plastic covering the the couch, I guess. Right. Yep. It's like a newly renovated section of the building that uh, is being borrowed for this. Okay. Mm -hmm. I think of the, the work mm -hmm. they did in uh, Half-Life Alex. Mm -hmm. to um to make the bottles of alcohol look like they had proper liquid in them mm -hmm. and they used like a shitload of shading tricks mm -hmm. uh paul where are you we've got a few hours i got i got a hold of simon jarrett let's do this i saw your laptop in the reception are you ready are you already here call me asap from david from david uh get your stuff ready hi paul and talk to Pace about using the lab this week. I have managed to uh, book the scanner for tomorrow morning and uh, again on Friday. It's not a lot, but they said we could uh, use the empty reception area as a kind of office. It would allow us to use the computer, use their computers to run models, and also if a time slot opens up, uh, we can get in there and use the scanner, uh, the scanner rig right away. I thought we could uh, run some tests tomorrow. We can, uh, we could do a scan of each other. Uh, to learn the equipment. It's supposed to be uh, pretty easy. On Friday, I'm opening Dr. Aaron Peak. I'm hoping uh, Dr. Aaron Peak will send somebody over. Uh, she has a uh, she has a patient that was recently in a car crash. It should be interesting. David, we're locked out. Oh, I found some extra time in the lab today. Unfortunately, nobody told us about the code change. So I called security and talked to Professor Wei to have him vouch for our project and finally got a hold of some honcho over at Pace's legal department that could re-grant us permission to use the lab. Uh, I'm not allowed to repeat the code in mails or texts, but I'll leave a note or something in case we forget. Oh, I guess there's a note around here. Yep. Hmm. Fucking, I, uh, I didn't read that computer the first time I came in here. And I was just fucking around in here for like 30 minutes. Yeah. I was trying to <laughs> see that open section this of the, the ceiling. Place, right? it must be I was trying to see if I could climb into that. Oh shit, I can call. Let's just call Machi real quick. Great. Got his phone turned off. Wow, what a fucking okay. asshole. I can figure this out. W wow, what a, what a fucking asshole. What, what, what? What are we doing? <laughs> <laughs> what are we doing? Hmm. The note should be somewhere around here. I think um, it's in drawers, if I remember right. Ah, didn't check drawers, yeah. Uh, that's not it. 
There we go. Hey, what is this? Uh, trial and error. Put your scalpel away. The brain can heal itself. The brain has an amazing transformative quality of uh, plasticity that allows it to comprehend. Uh, compensate even healing sounds, yana yana. Uh, is this our boy here? Yeah, I think, yeah, yep. this is David Munchie. Munchie's the boy on the left, and Berg is some guy that you never see again. Cool. Uh... They work together, I assume. <laughs> probably. Alright, what do we got here? Uh... There it is. 2501? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Gotta cool. be. Yep. It's squared out, so it must be. It's gotta be. 2501. There we go. Whee! Press and hold shift while running, while move to run. I can't get in there. That won't come up. Hmm. Eh. No, give me them med packs. Uh. You won't need that. Why not? Can't slap a band-aid on your brain. That's ridiculous. That's the only uh, party that's going to be bleeding, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm going to leave you in there for now. I want to go in here. I want to do just, just some exploring real quick. Go through this door for story. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, okay, that's the way I should avoid that. <laughs> The gamer mentality of, ah, that's progress. What's over here? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's the other a... times I've fucked myself with that, though, because I got it wrong. I'm like, that way looks like the way forward. I take a right, and then mm. blocks me in a room, and it's like, welcome to the way forward. I'm like, ah, dick. Nah, shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I've done that before, too. Like, God damn it. I didn't want to go this way. Hmm. Doesn't look like there's anything in here. Maybe this? No. That's just... Nothing in here that's worth grabbing or looking at. Lots of compoopers. Lots of compoopers. It's really fucking of... crazy that they just left the mobo on an active computer on the floor. Yeah. Oh, hi. Didn't hear you. Oh, hi, in. David. Simon Jarrett, right? Dr. Munchie? Well, it's uh, just Mr. Munchie, but I'm working on it. <laughs> actually, you're helping me. Ha ha ha. Actually, not a doctor. <laughs> yeah. I'm actually sure. I'm doing not a doctor. <laughs> 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 We hope to design a gentle way to work with brain reconstruction to help people like you. Hmm. Oh, did you uh, take the tracer fluid? Yes. Yes, I did. Great. Well, we can start whenever you're ready. Okay. Uh. Some brain stuff. Got some keyboard stuff. Got some keyboard some lamp stuff. stuff. A lot of computer stuff. Please have a seat. This thing needs a lot of power, apparently. Yeah. So, what exactly are we doing? We're going to do a scan of your brain. Then we build a computer model of it and bombard mm. it with stimuli. The program will help us to quickly iterate your treatment plan until it's fully optimized. In short, develop the perfect treatment for your condition. So it's not just a study. This will actually help me. Well, I should hope so. Otherwise, this would be a huge waste of time. <laughs> <laughs> Don't want that. Uh. Reminder, I'm not a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> Who let you in here? <laughs> hmm. I'm suddenly not trusting this man. Yeah, he's like studying for his doctorate. Mm. And uh, this right. is basically the basis of his thesis that will you are get him his PhD. Here, mm. Right. Canada, David Munchie, born 1988, July 16th. Right. Black no. Paragraph, version six. Good. All files in order. Well, this hurt. It's just a scan. It'll hurt about as much as getting your picture taken. Indians but that hurts me every time. Their souls. <laughs> but I'm in That's so much pain every time, though. Well, let's hope they're wrong. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> Say cheese. Say cheese. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, well, we're knocked out. Roll credits. <laughs> Roll credits. We're in Soma now. What happened? And now the game started. Oh. Thank you for resubscribing, old Jade Owl. Hello? Mr. Munchie, did something go wrong? Hello? 
This isn't funny. Hmm. I fucking love this section of the game. How do I? I'm not supposed to put myself in. Oh. Oh. Ah, there's blood. What is this place? How did I get here? What the hell? What the fuck going what on here? What the hell is going on here? Why are there scuba suits here? Are we underwater? Or are we in space? Oh, we could be in space. Hmm. What is this? Stand clear, doors open. Okay. Is there a way in? Wait. Is a shiny button? No. Never mind. Oh. Is there an Omni tool? I don't have one of those. Need to get ourselves an Omni tool if we want to dick with that. The fuck is an Omni tool? It's an Omni tool. It's a tool that does everything. Oh. Well, how do I get one? I don't know. I'll have to get out of this room first. How do I get out of this room first? Gotta find a creative solution. The door's not open. Fuck. Hmm. Can I get through here? I can't. Can I break through this glass? Wait. Oh! What the fuck? All right. Um, cracked on that glass? It was, it was a, it was this thing. <laughs> it was me. I'm the one who did it. <laughs> I am the boy who breaks. Smash. I am the boy who breaks. Wee. Can you go through there? Hmm. Uh, this place is uh, a little dark and spooky. Okay, maximize chat. What's in here? There we go. Now I could twin them side by side. Hell yeah. Is there anything in this toilet? No. Poop. Perfect. That's where people go duty. <laughs> oh my god. I have brain damage. I didn't, I didn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> That's a stupid video of the Joker talking to Batman. <laughs> like, <laughs> every poo poo time is also pee pee time. But not every pee pee time is poo poo time. You ever think about that, Mr. Batman? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I linked it in the fucking D&D &D Discord the other day when I was just shit posting. <laughs> it's just when he's interrogating him in, uh, in the Dark Knight. Mm. <laughs> they just that, dubbed that over. <laughs> that's so fucking funny. What is this? Is this a comb? Yeah, it's a comb. All right. Nothing in here? All right. Just stuff. Just some stuff. Some living quarters, perhaps. So that's entirely possible. All right. Came from that way, so we got to go this way. Or, I mean. Oh. Cool. Hello? Oh, 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 whoa, what the fuck? Ah, oh, my head's getting all glitchy. Hmm. Joker made something like Sama? That'd be terrifying. Ah! That's probably fine. Probably. Hmm. Whoa. Is it mass buff? Hold a sec. Still Gucci on my end. What's Gucci on your end? A lot of people in chat are saying they're getting a lot of buffering from the stream. Yeah. But Unfortunately, there's nothing I can do about it. Like, I can't switch modems and there's... I've already done everything I can. Mm. So... Yeah. You want some structure, Joe? Yeah, you do. So weird. Want some structure gel, buddy? The hell is structure gel? Yeah, try switching to 480p, chat. That should yeah. lower your buffering issues. Mm. How did 
did I do that? Oh. What? Maybe a bit. What the hell? Something did something. Something did something, all right. Hey, why don't you stop streaming to me? Uh, mm -hmm. I won't get it in a lifetime, but that'll at least ease your connection a bit. Maybe. Okay. Hmm. I've stopped streaming on Discord, so hopefully that helps chat, but if that doesn't work, then not a lot I can do. Yeah, that's, that's, uh, that might help at least a little bit. Yeah. Okay. That was weird. Was that open before? Was what open before? This fucking opening here. I don't think it was. Uh, no. Hmm. One of the machines is gone. Hmm. Oh, is your robot in there? Hmm. Are there killer robots here? In Soba? No. <laughs> no. Killer robots. They're only. They are love bots. <laughs> robots made for loving. Your fellow neighbor. Oh, I thought. Huh? Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, <laughs> what the fuck? What's coming out? Ah, uh, coming out. I, uh. The fuck? You know, I, I only thought wholesome things, is what I was thinking. Ah, uh, I see. <laughs> ah! What the fuck? Spooky stuff. There's, there's some spooky stuff right there, yeah. yeah I think there's a fuck. I think a man. Know, man. I think a man is being eaten by a robot over there on the other side of that door. Hmm. I think the game wants me to go in there. Hmm. Mr. Not Ozzy, you know, it's true. Oz Internet is is not ideal. I'm coming out. I'm coming out. So you better yeah, get, get this party started. Uh, what is this? Omni Tool. What is this? The Omni Tool is an advanced interface for accessing, managing, and controlling computerized systems. The onboard intelligence uh, includes an open set of behaviors and protocols to enable the user to automate uh, routine actions through basic logical charts. Over the over time, the Omni tool may automatically adapt its programs to cover a subconscious behavior to optimize work and to minimize user error. The Omni tool has assurance. Yeah, yeah whatever. Fucking Omni tool, go burr. <laughs> Omni tool, go burr. Give me that Omni tool. Yeah, that's basically, I think, how a lot of people who get Omni tools would react. They pick it up like, all right, the Omni tool does. Yep, all right. Hey, there we around? go. Uh, it said tab to open my inventory, but I don't have an inventory. Oh, okay. I guess that's it. Uh, okay. What the hell? Is that a body? Can't tell. It's all. Hmm. Well, I should probably leave. I'll tell you maybe in seven seconds. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I'm not getting any more buffering in mind. I think stopping streaming to me was the right choice. Okay, cool. Maybe he's just that little extra bit of strain fucked with everything. Yeah, it could be a body. Definitely looks like something missing a head, doesn't it? Yeah. Someone had a light over there. Hmm. 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 Is there any 
thing As knows. The questions yeah. get anger. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> get out of here. Hello. And now I'm locked in with it. Uh, oh, there we go. Oh yeah, because you gotta go programming on me too. From the place from where you started from. You there? Oh, perfect. Yeah. Uh, give me that system status. Uh, emergency systems. Thirteen days remaining. Oh. Okay. Back. What the fuck is that? Uh, David Munch. Um. Hmm, what were you working on there, David? Um. Uh, it was actually a teleporter. Mm hmm. Welcome back, Louise Moran. Uh. Yeah, your Omni is in perfect condition, but not fit with a tool chip. I don't have a fucking tool chip. Uh, Cortex chip. Don't have one. Toolbox. Oh. I know they told you that field technicians would get full access throughout Pesos 2. I'm here to tell you that's not gonna happen. Don't get me wrong, I don't wanna get in your way. We need you guys to keep this place up and running, but there needs to be at least some level of security on these things. Hmm. I don't want to hear you barge into some quarantined area at Omicron and just knock down the whole place with some virus or whatever the hell they're doing over there. What are they doing over this here? This is what you can do. You'll be able to use it to open doors. Basically what all of them. Speak? If you can, yeah. there's something wrong or someone didn't want you in there. Then what do you do? You shove that Omni tool into a terminal and see if you can't get around it somehow. I mean, sometimes you'll need to get into places where you don't belong. Just find a way. You're an engineer for crying out loud. What else? Take care of your gear. Don't be an asshole. That's about it, really. My name is John Strohmeyer, Pathos 2 security operative. I got an office at Theta. Come see me if you got any issues. You can't Hello, look up, Lynn. Good luck. Oh, hello, you little goblin. All right. Inventory. Uh, cool. All right, something open here. What is this? Oh, is what chip? A, oh, what, is it a data chip? Is it a cortex chip? No, it's just... I don't know what this is. I can't see it yet. I'm still looking at Stromar. Can I insert? Oh, wait. Chip! Perform insertion. It is a tool chip. All right. Update. That'll let you use the Omni tool. Ew. Tool chip security cipher. Updated. Now it's not just a, now it's not a fucking paperweight. <laughs> Thank God. Now we can open things. Mm-hmm. Uh... Yeah, that one's useless. Now okay. that you have one, you salad. Woo! Now oh, what's in here? Pilot seat number three, Upsilon. Oh my God. Is that just... Is that just gonna keep going on forever? Okay. Sounds like it. With the orientation? Yeah. Yeah, the, basically. Not the orientation, but the, um... Fucking... I wandered over to a different thing. Uh -huh. I'm guessing it is very delayed. <laughs> uh, I'm about 12 to 13 seconds behind you. Okay. Yeah, so you're watching the infinite line of code? Yeah. Hmm. That's what the inside of your brain looks like, I guess. Oh, that's neat. Glad my obsolete. brain can be summed up into a bunch of numbers and letters. Greek numerals. <laughs> mm-hmm. Uh, let's see. Pilot report. Uh, Carl Semkin. Uh, Amy Zara, you know, task. Replace heat shields. You know, you know, notes. 
Semkid reported uncharacteristic levels of nausea after the mission. Diagnos uh, diagnostics show a spike of electromagnetism surrounding the pilot helmet, uh, which is believed to be the cause of Semkin's symptoms. Uh, no indication to what created this anomaly. Atten attention. The pilot system has become increasingly unreliable. Everyone who's been using it in the uh, using it the last couple of months has been having headaches and spells of nausea. Last week, Gavin was knocked out for 30 hours when trying to direct a helper cluster. Uh, this is not acceptable. We will figure this out. Uh, for the time being, I'm shutting down the usage of the pilot system. Uh, this means you will have to do some uh, more heavy lifting, uh, performing the operations through programming or physical labor. No one is happy about this, so don't bother complaining. All right, seems like that's the most we can do here. Hmm, where do I go from here? Is there something in here I can maybe fuck with? Fuck, fuck is this? owl sending me email. Look, hey, you want one more Japanese? Oh, like, yeah, later. Expected. I'd love to. a really to. hard time getting the doors open. Call Permaseal as many as you can. Rather not take any chances. Roger. Did you cut off the factory floor? All done. Should keep most of them out. I'm on my way to lock off the comm center. Just make sure to leave a way out of here. Trust me, I'll get you the data safe and sound. We just need to make sure we're leaving our power running so we don't have to return. I hear that. See you back at camp. Hmm. Okay. What's going on? Data buffer go well, 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 well. Well, 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 well. Hmm. Anything else I can do? Oh, there's a bit over here I haven't done. I had a map. Yeah, maps make a lot of things easier. Uh, you kind of get some later. <laughs> kind of? Maybe? They're in fixed location. Oh! Gonna back up. Here. B I. Safe or safe food. Safe or safe food. Hmm. What's over here? Damn you! Fucking just randomly triggered uh, events. How dare you spook me? You think you can just come in here and be spooky, you son of a gun? Wanna fight? Yeah, you all ride up for a smack bottom. Mm-hmm. Your bottom? About to get smacked. Oh, time to answer your question. Is the, is the game sufficiently spooky? Um, not as spooky as Amnesia so far, but... Yeah, it's a very different kind of horror. Yeah. Uh, is this where I came? Yeah, this is where I came back from. So, good. Okay. Our hallway is like a big loop. Mm. An oval. Oh, wait. Wrong way. Here we go. Alright, what do we got here? We're underwater! We Ooh. in the ocean. We it's horrible. Ocean. I love it. I love it. What is this? Like nothing happened. Everything still looks the same. All silence alike. Hmm. Well, someone's been drawing them fish. And more fish and a person. Yeah. Uh, Under the, the sea. Under the sea. Under the sea. 
Uh, back indifference. Uh, thick structure chill. They can't shake. Wows. Uh, freaky fishes. Hmm. Okay. That's cool. You know what? We need some water. Wait, is this empty? Hell yeah. This is empty! This bitch empty. Yay! <laughs> Yay! This is also empty! Alright. Well, I hate this. This is going to be very, very, very bad for me. So far, not as scary as Subnautica. <laughs> yeah, I think one of the other things about Subnautica that makes it kind of scary the most games is that it's entirely player motivated. Yeah, absolutely. You can not do anything for forever and stay in the safe shallows and be like, ooh, no hurt me, and the game will wait. <laughs> it's like, yeah. all right. It's like, okay. Fine. Whatever you say. You have to choose to do it. Well, games like this, like, it's like, all right, do you want to play or not? Yeah. <laughs> so not like, you could play and you could be like, uh-uh, <laughs> just stay there forever. And it's like, that's fine with me. By all means, mm -hmm. slowly use up the resources. Ah! What was that? I don't know. I don't know what that was. Uh, well, that was spooky. Hmm. Ah, uh, wait. Okay. I gotta crawl through here. Is there gonna be anything spooky in here? in my crawl. Crawling in my crawl. Man. Is it gonna be something spooky in here? Is there gonna be a, 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 de a robot devil in here? Hmm? Mm, couldn't be the first one, right? No. Do I know some not a sequel coming out? I own it. It was given to me. Hell yeah. It's gonna release in the next few uh next few weeks here. Aaron is very excited. It's gonna be phenomenal. I'm gonna hate every second of it. <laughs> yep. Below zero, not sub zero. Uh, yeah, it is. It's uh, it's technically not happening after they happen at the same time. So, but it is the sequel game. Uh, it's not finished. It's not come. It is. It is in early access. It's final uh, 1.0 patch, uh, or rather the 1.0 patch. I guess they're not going to do any post patches. Um, is releasing in leakage. the next month or so. Can't confirm its effect on WAU. Issue has been reported to SSE. Wall check. Isn't this just wonderful? What? Hey, can you hear me? Oh, you heard it. <laughs> oh, well, I didn't know it was a person until I pulled it out. It, well, I'm sorry, robot. I need it. Why? I was okay. I was happy. Well, I'm sorry. <laughs> I, uh, I may have killed you. But that's, that's fine. Uh, manual boot sequence. Okay. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay. And... Okay. Yeah, that was probably one of the easiest little mini games. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Hooray! Got the lights on! Oh, wait. Something is going horribly wrong. Oh, God, what have I done? Oh, that's right. Okay. You're just firing at the engine. Yeah. 
nice. Get in contact oh, with the place now. Maybe you can find people. What? What's happening? Oh shit. Hello? Is, is there a people? There? One hey, of those hey, things is online. Oh. Can I hear you? He's even dialing uh, for you. I'm oh my god. What's going on? There's a person. Uh, I, I have no idea. I, I just sort of woke up here. In the room right now? Uh, it, was, it was like a, a seat with a helmet. Is that right? Uh, what's your name? I, I'm Simon Jarrett. And what are you... Oh, signal. Damn relays. Where are you now? Uh, 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 someplace dealing with electrical power. I, I'm not sure if it's a plant or a transformer. Uh, yeah, you're probably in a dome me? plant somewhere. You want to go mm -hmm. upstairs to the comm center. That's no, It's the room with the dome ceiling. <laughs> uh, hey, oh, no. Look, look, this place is not... Oh, here I go. We're running. There's something seriously <laughs> wrong here. Hello? I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. We lost another relay. Just listen, head for the comm center upstairs. I'll wait here. You got it, lady. She told me to go upstairs to meet her in the comm center. Oh, I got an achievement. It says, answering the call. Okay, everything is nice and lit. Nothing can get me here in the light. By the liquid hot magma. By the liquid hot magma. Turn on the thing real quick. Huh? I'll just be one sec. Okay. Oh boy. You got yourself a date. Yeah, I did. Oh, she's gonna be my, my new wife. there hmm what's over here oh my god oh that's wonderful hmm nothing over here oh fuck oh shit what the hell is that what the fuck is that monster oh my god I ran into a monster. Yeah, that one will fucking kill you. But no, I'm sure he's just trying to say hi. That's why it fucks up my screen when I look. Yeah. The big boy too. Oh, uh, I don't like him. I don't like him at all. Fucking got the perception of a. Uh... Heckin' barbarian with dumb standard whiz. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh shit, I can't. I thought this was the way to go. I guess not. Well, this is where he came from. He's just hanging out in here. Probably knocked all that shit down. Probably. Yeah, you can just wander off. Oh shit. Oh no. Wait, hold on. Wait, no. Leave me alone. <laughs> Finger of the space button. Mm hmm. So, what are we dealing with here? Like, I'm not sure. Some sort of robot. Some sort of robot, like, space thing. Underwater. Oh, underwater, yeah. Maybe? Maybe. I hope it can't fly. Ah, fuck! <laughs> I was going to say, I hope he can't climb ladders. <laughs> He can hear. Leave me be. Leave me alone. The upper ramp. Uh, can I get up here? Uh, is this fucking staircase gonna fucking fall apart on me? <laughs> Everything falls apart when it's you like, try eh, to go up. I can't make any progress. Everything's breaking. Uh. Something exploded. Eh. When you start turning a valve, it just comes off. You're like, 
と。<笑>
really make getting forward easier. Mm-hmm. There's okay, a dude he's here. Dead. He's dead. Dude, you say? Yeah. That's Carl. Hey, Carl. 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 Zero seven Carl two two. Who's Carl Semkin again? Is that the dude we just talked to? Maybe. <laughs> Very possible. Sorry, possible. Go ask him if he's in a state to talk. Hey, Carl. <laughs> hey, Carl, how are you doing? Uh, uh, trying to be fucking funny? Give me a medic. But you're a robot. Really? <laughs> Do robots have legs, hands, a face? You're delusional. Okay, <laughs> calm down. I, I won't. Get some fucking help. <laughs> Get me Holland. He's a little pissed. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. But you know you have an employee ID. That's true. Fucking what was it again? Oh god. I just wanted to check his ID again. Backup turbo's going. Everything is wired evenly. We've hedged our bets as much as we possibly can. So that's it? It's not uh, power one pay toss two until the next apocalypse. We're ready to go. I really hope we didn't mess anything up. I don't want to have to come back here again. Relax, it's over. We're going to data. We sealed everything, everything from the barracks to the comm center. If anyone ever sets their foot here again, they're going to have a hell of a time getting a rock off. Oh. oh. Well, he had a bad time. I can touch him again. Did you get the final backup turbos going? Everything is wired evenly. Oh, this is the same thing. Okay. Yeah. You can just go over the information as much as you want. Fucking, how do I? Is there a way to check my fucking Tab notes and stuff? Can't remember the ID number. Um, Is that zero seven two two? Try that. <laughs> there we go. Mail. What you get? What do you have for mail? Two. Heather. Um, like power reduction has been secured. We've sealed off the factories to keep the plan. Oh, keep the plan running. Oh yeah, that was wall check you touched. Uh, all super, uh, super uh, superfluous uh, systems have been turned off. If anyone ever, uh, ever has to return, know that the power flow regulator is hanging by a thread. If you flip the switch, it's probably a no turning back situation. We're out of here, Carl. Okay. Oh, he didn't send this. Mail not sent. Link cannot be established. Well, that's that's depressing. Power manager. <laughs> Shame. Mm-hmm. Uh. Uh. Solution found. Shut down one of the highlighted sections to divert power to the. Communication center. Oh, I see. Put down one of those two uh -huh. in order to divert power. Uh huh. Okay. Well, um. Hmm. There's one behind you, and there's one, uh, which you know where it is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I do know where it is. The other one's down the hall, past the body. Staff. Oh yeah, turning on those should open certain doors, if I remember right. Hmm. Nope. Yeah, sucks for wall check. Looks like, uh... Looks like she had a bad time. Yeah. Uh, brief introduction to the CZ, CCRV7 black box. The black box is a, uh, is a precision instrument designed to, designed to overall uh, observe your overall condition. It measures a wide range of data from body temperature to brain wave activity. This. I can provide you with a hey, You now know what the wow is. Oh. 
Stop it. Uh. Wait. Can I not take it? Well, make sure to take your hard hat. Um. Injecting yourself with that implant won't do you anything. Darn. All it does is tell the WoW where you are. Oh, okay. But since all the systems are offline, um, it, it wouldn't really help the WoW tell anyone where you are. Hmm. I see. Well, nothing in there. Hmm. Do Storage, we wanna... not useful. Do we want to fuck over Carl here? Hmm. Hey, Carl. Still mad at me? Yeah. I believe they remain permanently mad. Go tell the others. You're kind of. There's kind of no hope for you, dude. Please I'm sorry, friend. Me. What do you mean he's I not a robot? Help. No. What is he? He's Carl. He's Carl. <laughs> I'm sorry, Carl, but you're kind of a lost cause. Alright. Alright, manager. Is that the one? I did it. Power to the comm center. Alright. Have to turn power off to other places in order to reroute it to the other one. Hmm, I see. Now that it's on, can I turn this off now? Or does it have to kind of stay on? Uh, if you were to turn that off, then it would have to shut down the power. The uh, power from here is being rerouted to open up the comm center and make it active. Hmm. Well, shit. Shame. <laughs> Shame. What is this? Workshop? What is this? Is this a fucking a robot man? Looks like it. I didn't seem to do anything. Hmm. All right. Hmm. Nothing around here that can help. Okay. Seem to be. Vertical system failure, please reboot. Okay. All right. I'm sorry, Carl. I'm so sorry. <laughs> sorry about traveling about that. There's nothing I could have done. Uh, hmm. Josie, has Eva come along? We've got everything we need to move, but we can't leave the plant without supervision. Adams decided to leave Amy, Asaro, and Kalsanka to execute the automatization process. And I bet they're thrilled about it. I just wanted to let you know we're on schedule and I'll talk to you tomorrow. All right, I'll pass on the mole check. Josie, I'll be going for an evac, am I right? It will do. I wanted to introduce you to Amy and Co. They'll be doing the talking as soon as I leave for Theta. Say hello. Hey, Theta. Hello. Hey, guys, I'm Peter Strass, doing dispatcher at Theta. Just let me know if there's anything I can do to help. I suppose that's it. I'll see you real soon. When we arrive. All right, Johnson, have a safe trip. Mm. Hey, hello, Beta. Absalon, what's up? We could really use direct contact with Heather. I mean, uh, site service engineer Wolchek. Direct links are almost impossible to establish. The Lumar relays are basically junk at this point. You could send messages via the comm center. And if you want, I'm pretty much always here. Ready to relay anything by hand. I know it's a shitty system, but it's all that works right now. Yeah. Subnautica right. got a lot darker. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean Subnautica got darker? Subnautica's already really fucking dark. 
It's true. Did you start diving into any of the lore about what happened to anyone else on the planet? You're like, oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Even the ending to Subnautica is like not great. Oh no! I don't even really use game. Hmm. And then you get to go back. Go on. Do you do you find out that you were the one who blew up the fucking uh, the, the big old ship at the beginning? Uh, I'm gonna lie and say yes. Darn. <laughs> I'm sad you had to lie. Um, did we ever get to the second island with you guys? I'm pretty sure you saw the the sunbeam come in before we quit. Um, we got. I remember getting to an island like a. a human. Yeah, we got to the one island. There's two. I mm. can't remember if we did the second island or not. I don't think we did. The second island is a true island, and the one that you went on was the floating island. Hmm. But yeah, um, your rescue uh, comes, and there's a big old countdown, and uh, shocker, uh, oh. does it go as planned? Uh huh. And uh, then, um, in it not going as planned, you find out that something on the planet makes it so maybe ships trying to show up or leave have a bad time. That fucking sucks. Yep. There's also a couple records on the uh, Aurora when you go fix it. Mm. And when you loot it. Because you have to kind of go back and forth from it a couple times later in the game. Uh, there are some like black box logs where they're like, yeah, something fucking shot us. <laughs> a better way to fall asleep than to the melody of Carl's scream. <laughs> Delightful. Hey, are you there? I found the dome ceiling. Oh, that's better. Simon, was it? Uh, Jared, Simon Jared. Hi, Simon. I'm Catherine. Have you figured out what's going on yet? Hey, hey, that I was girl. hoping you'd have some answers. I probably have some. What do you want to know? Where do you even begin? I mean, what is this place? How did I get here? And, and why do the robots talk like they're people? Well, you're at Epsilon, clearly. Have you never been there before? Clearly. The Grimoire in Toronto. Is that really important? No, I mean, where did you work at Pezos 2? I don't know what that is. That's unexpected. Did you come directly from Toronto? Yeah, I did. And it was very unexpected. Have you seen any people? Like, staff or field technicians? Only robots. Crazy ones. Except for one. I, I think he was in pain. I'm not sure what to do. He said he was hurting. Sort of. I don't know. What was that? No! What's going on? Whoa! I think this place is about to collapse. What do I do? Simon, come to Lambda. Uh, how do I get there? Good old Oh, oh she'll wait for me. Oh, heck. I'm drowning. Shit. Shit. Oh, uh, no. What should I... Oh, We're gonna Epic. die. We're gonna well, die. I'm dead. Well, good game, this everybody. This is the end. <laughs> yep. I'm alive. Oh, they were okay. <laughs> sort of. What the hell? How is this possible? Oh, was I a robot the, the whole time? What? <laughs> this, is, this is insane! I'm a robot? <gasps> uh, Frankly, an insane assertion, Spencer. <laughs> we were in Toronto not an hour ago. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You're right. This is just... How could we be in a, a robot now? How could, how could uh, under the ocean? Robots that's, in my Valentino bag. <laughs> <laughs> Frankly, that's just stupid. How do I get out of here? Um. <laughs> the hole. The hole. Can't get out. Eh. Go, 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 go
the bounce, the big jumpy legs. Eh. Eh. Oh, wait. Okay. Okay, give me the prompt now. It's in the hole. It's in the hole. What? That's the orb. Where did it come no. from? Came from the hole. <laughs> <laughs> One thing at a time. <laughs> All right. What do we got? Frankly, I'd be more worried about the interdimensional space octopus. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh. Now that I'm underwater, nothing can I harm me. Find the shuttle to land there. <laughs> I'm a robot. S said every dead scientist. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hmm. Hello. Are there sharks down here? Uh, not here, but deep enough. Sure. Why not? Sure. Sounds reasonable. Sharks infected by the wow. Yeah. I think I saw a another thing. show. There are good things in the water and there are bad things in the water. I'm sure there are only good things in the water, Aaron. You're right. I'm just a Why would they want communist. to harm a regular person who can just breathe underwater from Toronto? Just because I have Heckin' uh, summonable Come armor as is also scuba suit. <laughs> yeah. Where were you? It's a field. I had to leave. Did call with you? It all went to hell. Hold on. You, you got the power automated, right? The, the plant is safe. We need the power to keep the sites running. Oh, fuck the power! Fuck you, Strasky! The machines killed Carl. Oh shit. Oh, all right. Um, calm yeah, down. Yeah, shit. Okay, okay, fine. Get back to Theta? Yeah. I think so. Hmm. I'll head for the show. The the first. Good luck, <laughs> for you. I just hack Spencer's computer and mod the game oh. to have them in it. <laughs> that would be unfortunate. The same bananas AI. So you see their noses clipping through walls as they try and get inside. Mm -hmm. B A N A N A S. Weirdly enough, it's much calmer under the water. Oh, never well, mind. <laughs> That's a robot. I yep, lied to but you. usually, usually the game's pretty clear about which robots aren't your friend. <laughs> yeah, the one that with a fucking red light coming out of its face. Yeah. Yeah. Um, one thing that's really fucking cathartic. Uh huh. Is once you've built a base and started like doing shit in Subnautica. Um, you can get a torpedo add-on for your Seamoth. Uh-huh. And you can't get explosive torpedoes, oh. but you can get, uh, poison gas torpedoes, or you can get, like, vortex torpedoes, where they just make a massive, like, fucking cyclone in the water and just yeet enemies. Mm hmm He's just looking right at you like, hey, what you doing? What you doing? I just want to see what would happen. <laughs> oh, fuck. Hi. Dorcas. <laughs> yeah, you kind of get like one or two freebies where it hurts you, but doesn't fuck you up. Hmm. And then, uh, and then you die. That's fair. This boy wants to, uh, he wants some food, I guess. Yeah. If the food is structure gel. <laughs> Where the hell do I go? Uh, you gotta go to the next uh, base. <laughs> There's no more past him. Hmm. She seemed to be done. Yeah. He also went down into a corner after he fucking nailed you in the face. Yeah, true. 
seems to. Well, I guess I wandered into. Follow an area. the lights. They usually, usually direct you fairly well. Hmm. When they had people trying to, occasionally manually move through oh, these bases. Hey, friend. Yeah, you can just kind of stealth over by him. Mm -hmm. He has, uh, I think he's got a pretty set path. Mm -hmm. Just talk it out. Just have a reasonable conversation. It'll be fine. Yeah. No, I'm sure he just wants to ha like, he just wants a friend. That's it. So he, he's also trying to figure out what's going on. Yeah. Is all. Don't be greedy, Don't be greedy man. <laughs> hey, come back here. Hey, guy, come on. Give me. Gilb. Please. I just want some food. I went backwards. Yeah, I was like, I'm, you might be going back the way you came. Yeah. <laughs> I wasn't sure. I like, I don't know where the fuck to go. You gotta go past him. You went. Okay, I was past him. Past, you went past him to the right. You wanna go past him to the left? Oh. The area he's like properly guarding. Makes sense. He is your threshold guardian. He just kind of goes in a circle. Yeah. You can dip left, you can go around the rock and just fucking go around here as well. Yeah, true. I just don't, I don't want to bother him. He's not super smart beep boop, he just beep boop. He just wants, he just wants some, some food. Just wants to scream random phrases well, and yeah. try and eat your brain. Yeah, that's, a, that's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Kerbozzi's right, it's like, damn you lack of minimap. Damn nah, at, least you. We're, at least we're not in the midnight zone. The midnight zone? Yet. Uh, the depth of water where you're so far down that the sun's light can't make it to you. Oh yeah, fuck that. Mm -mm. No thanks. What is that? There's a little robot stuck. I got you, little man. I saved you. I love him. I, oh, he's adorable. He is friend. Mm. <laughs> this is Hooray. one of the good things in the water. <laughs> oh, thank God. <laughs> he will help you out when you need him the most. Okay. Which is always because he's very comforting and has a light. <laughs> oh, thank <laughs> Christ. All right. Where do I go? <laughs> oh, are we at the ship already? No, we can't be. No. Can't no, we're be. not there yet. Yeah, that's later. <laughs> I was gonna be like, really? It's gonna fuck with you that fast? <laughs> that that area is probably the hardest part of the whole game, I think. Really? Sheer difficulty was. It's just uh, the monster in there is pretty fucking quick, and it's ah. a bit of a maze. So you're running through a sunken boat, and if you fuck up, then he's gonna catch you and you're gonna start over again. <laughs> Ugh! Fuck that. It's uh, it's good, but it's spooky. Hmm. Big glowing signs will have uh, doorways to inside areas. Oh, Another one on your right. Not glitchy. It's a monster. Oh, it's that thing there. Okay. Where am I going? That guy's just running into the fucking place. Hmm. Bonk. Bonk. I don't know where to go. I don't know where to go. I don't know where to go. Ooh, ooh. I don't know where to go. I don't know where to go. Hmm. You're hugging a lot of stuff. You gotta pull back and get yourself in that proper view of the area. There's also a lot of paths around, which will help. Yeah. Here you go. 
Keep left. Left. Huh. Yeah. You're going underneath. Hmm. Which you don't need to do anything down here. Okay. Is that sign right there? That's the one I think you were going for. Here. So I get to substation B. Yeah. Dang. And up somewhere. <gasps> well, those are just the markers that tell you how to go go places. Hmm. So like there's signs that'll tell you like if you go down this path it'll take you to this area. Mm-hmm. There's those little lights on the ground. Those will guide you. Hmm. Bother me none. I'm just minding my own business. Oh, don't mind me none. <laughs> just being a a nice old ship captain <laughs> from a, <laughs> a sunken boat from a, a two thousand years ago. <laughs> just three of my uh, trapped down here in David Jones Lock. <laughs> <laughs> Boop. Shall I take him? Oh my God, he's gonna. I'm gonna break in for me. Yep, he's got your back. Thanks, bro. He literally couldn't beat the game without him. Aww. <laughs> you ignore him. him and just fuck off fast. <laughs> you can try and push that button, it just doesn't open. And <laughs> you just be like, what the fuck <laughs> do I do? Uh, just go back and let him out. <laughs> that'd be so bad. Uh, be really right. confusing more than anything if you didn't know that there was a like a way to weld the selfie. You'd be like, Yeah, it doesn't fucking help. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> but what the hell happened? Barnacles, there's a lot of growth in here. Yeah, there is. It seems strange. Mm. Oh, it takes a while, right? <clears throat> yeah, it takes a while. Let's hope the shuttle still work. Uh huh. Yo, come on, 18 months? Hell yeah. Second Wait, Twitch baby. Wait, where's my little friend? Where's my little He's friend? Outside. He can't come inside. He doesn't no! have feet. No! I need his light. Okay, you'll see him again. How did I. Where did I get a flashlight? But yes, uh -huh. you do need his light. When did I get a flashlight? Crazy, yes. right? Said me, the Your robot. No, little beep I'm at the shuttle, but it's not looking good. The lights flicker like mad. I, I think that's fine. But here's another one of the more horrifying parts of the game. Mm. I have to fix it. I don't want to get stranded halfway to Theta. What was that? I can't hear you. Don't worry. I'll fix it. Somehow. Oh, Carrie's back. Carrie's back in chat. Hi, Carrie. Why aren't you resting, you bitch? Rest better! Insufficient power. Insufficient Always power. power. Always <laughs> missing power. Oh shit, it's eating me! Oh, Jesus yeah. Christ! Those little buttholes also hell? heal you. Rude. Alright. Come on now. Darn it. Mmm, delicious. Ooh, delicious uh person. With gunk and tablets and doodles. Love it. Oh, some some doodle little beep boop on the back. Aw. Manifest. On this morning of January 12th, the, uh, the comet Talos uh, crashed into the Pacific Ocean. The impact ranks as one of the largest collisions ever recorded on Earth. All evidence indicates that the surface has gone completely barren and is no longer able to sustain life. 
Oh my god. Pathos 2's unique location has provided unparalleled safety for our staff. Uh, some structural damage has been noted, but no casualties reported. The largest loss was the weather and communications station uh, located on the surface platform Omega, unmanned. Uh, which is under circumstances, uh, which is under the circumstances a small price to pay. Um, uh, Theta will hold an emergency meeting to discuss the future of Pathos 2 and uh, ultimately mankind. More on the matter will follow. Oh my god. The surface has been destroyed. Yeah. How we get this train to move? We gotta turn some power off. Seems so. Sleep more important than dates? I don't know, man. I could go for a date. Not the fruit. It doesn't taste very good. They're basically just giant lying raisins. <laughs> giant lying raisins? Yeah. Raisins taste better than dates. Ah, uh, that's true. Well, I've never had a date, so I don't, I don't know, but I like raisins. Is there a limit, uh, a limit to, uh, like the black light? How long nope. I can use it? Oh, perfect. Sure it just stays there forever. Oh, thank God. I like this much better than the fucking lamp and then in amnesia. No, oh, yeah, we need to like recharge it. Yeah, yeah. No, it's just like, conveniently there. Don't know how you got it and you never really hold one, but you know, you have one. See, so, yeah, this huh. is horrifying. Hey, this are you? stuck Don't with me, me for a bit, just looking at them. Can I help? They won't let me die. Nothing is allowed to die. What happened? An accident. Fixing the power. Oh. I was going to Theta. Anything it's keeping them alive. See masters mm. in Holland. Tell them I need help. Okay? Amy needs help. She's Amy. Well, I could fucking kill her. Uh, look like. Yup. Yeah. Yup. Yeah. I think I have to. Yup. Yeah. yeah. If you want that train to move. No. No. Are you okay? Can I put it back in? Nope. Sorry, Amy. Well, we've got it. We've killed a person. To yeah, so avoid killed... having to walk. Yeah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> it's okay. We killed Carl earlier. It's fine. <laughs> it's true. It's not like this is new in our pattern. Yeah. It's not like we haven't killed before. It is, it is a definite shame when the human race is being wiped out by a comet and uh, just icing random ladies just doesn't seem like it's copacetic. It feels extra bad. Yeah. <laughs> really doing a bigger blow percentage wise to the whole of humanity. This flashlight barely does anything. 
Hell, yeah. for all we know, that was the last one. That's it. Humans are gone. We, we just fucking killed humanity now. GG. GG humanity. That's not the way. Oh. Can we get in here? Nope. Yeah, we can. The happy train. I fucking love the, the design of these trains. Mm hmm. Let's see. Floodable airlock for a fair say. Okay. Carrie, I'll fight you. <laughs> what did you say? This is fine. fine. Obviously, you guys hate me and want me to leave. I'll kill you. That's me you're talking about. Standing <laughs> by. GG humanity hashtag robots for life. Mm. Did I do it? Gotta I be sitting it. down. Ah, there we go. Okay. We want to go. Fuck, I don't know where to go. <laughs> Well, we gotta get a lambda first. No matter what. Here we go. <laughs> we didn't kill all the humans. You're still alive. A very normal human from Toronto. Welcome to Pathos 2, your expressway to the stars. What started as a thermal mining operation in the 60s has now become home to the Omega Space Gun, the world's most affordable way to launch satellites and deep space probes. Mm. Our unique Atlantic Ocean location allows for this gigantic coil gun, running longer than a marathon, to safely launch projectiles without risk of damaging well, I fought carry. risky combustion. What? I said, well, I fought carry. Not really sure who won. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Did you do some lasting damage at least? Well, I got a hug out of it, so I mean, I don't know. Well, some hard damage. Yeah. Research projects within the marine sciences, including hydroculture, turbulence, and deep sea construction. We are now leaving Upsilon for Lambda. Lambda is Pathos 2's shipping dock and transportation hub. There, you will be able to find shuttle trains leading to all the other parts of the station. Okay. Track obstructed. Uh oh. oh shit. Ah, <laughs> shit. Bad day, bad day, bad day. Bad day, bad day, bad day, bad day. I'm gonna scream like a little girl. That's not how uh, Soma do. Amnesia, maybe. Uh, yeah. Machine for pigs, a little bit, but not really. Uh, it's mostly um, it's mostly the dark ten is the most like that moments. Mm -hmm. It's okay. This, this game I'm is alive. more. Oh fuck! But how do we get out? The fuck? I know. Through the really cool way. That way. Mhm. Mm I'm getting all glitchy. Something's chasing me. That's impossible. Uh, maybe. So it's gone now. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Whatever it was, it's behind of the train and can't get to you. Hooray! I killed it. Poor meow. I've killed it. I've killed it dead. Hello? Simon, Simon are you there? Catherine, is that you? I was on my way, but then the shuttle train. It, it I'm just a simple crashed. farm girl, right? freshly graduated from farm girl school. Mm -hmm. No, I'm not all right. What the hell happened Bandits. to the world? Why are we underwater? And they want me to do oh, what? Right? <laughs> oh me, oh my. Oh me, oh my. 
How close? Can I walk there? Yeah, but the tunnel is locked off to protect the overall structure from collapsing. What you need to find is your section's maintenance hatch. It'll lead outside. Maintenance hatch. No problem. What is that? What's going on up there? I gotta go. See you soon, Simon. Goodbye. Gooby. I'll miss her. You okay? Mm-hmm. It's a shame she's dead. Yeah. Yeah. Or she's the one trying to kill us. <gasps> what a monster. No. That bitch. <laughs> that filthy whore. <laughs> this is not the man who drained his nugs in me. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> oh. From their old, uh, old, it was from the Breath of the Wild playthrough. Mm. Fucking, how do I get in there? Don't look like you can. Oh, jeez. Well, I guess I gotta go back now. Must be some sort of other way out of here. Some sort of, some sort of secret side entrance. Maybe. Oh, exit. Like that one, that fucking... Totally easy to miss. <laughs> yeah, I was like, say, like, was that there before? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's. I think almost everyone goes forward, touches the butthole, turns around. They're like, oh fuck. <laughs> ah heck. Oh man. Yeah, no, because of that playthrough, they were like, they posted highlights from it a while back. Just drained. And drained and <laughs> <laughs> like one of my favorite horrible euphemisms for bang. <laughs> it's like it's repulsive. It's the worst. It's really gross. <laughs> yeah. Dream my nugs. Hey. Is that plus the surfer voice really going? With it? Yeah. Uh... Aha! Yes, let me out. Nah, see? Nah, see? Yeah. Here we go! It's a good thing barnacles didn't encrust this ladder upwards, stopping me from being able to reach it. <laughs> that would fucking be the worst. That'd be... I can fucking I would be right? Dead. <laughs> mm -hmm. How big can this ocean be? D that, what a dumb question. <laughs> How big can the Atlantic Ocean be? Said the dummy. How many oceans does the planet have? Uh, two. One. One. They're all connected. We just named them. Oh. <laughs> we've decided. <laughs> really, oh. we've named sections of it. <laughs> Fair enough. There's like a whole queue. I think about that. Mm -hmm. Or they fucking, they gave it like, cause it's an obvious like bait question where you're like, well, we've got the Indian Ocean, the Arctic Ocean, the Pacific Ocean, the Atlantic Ocean. And so people would be like, oh, you know, like six, seven, something like that. And it was like, nope. And so no matter what number you gave, they would, <laughs> they would be wrong. Like mm -hmm. they're all the same body of water. It's just, we've arbitrarily decided that different sides of North America makes it different oceans. Mm. We're fools. It's all just one ocean. Nuzu. Dispose of Muzu for my amuse. Yes, I love that play. It's so cute. <laughs> Muzu, man. Dispose of Muzu for my amuse, man. Oh, shit. Hi, guy. No, wait. Hi. No, wait, friend. Yeah. No, Stop friend! It. Leave me alone, Stop. friend! You'll be able to outrun. Pretty fucking slow. There's no need to chase your friends. Calm down, you fucking bastard. <laughs> Calm down, you fucking bastard. <laughs> Fuck. Alright, uh, I think I'm going the right way still. Just going out for an Atlantic walk. <laughs> Trying to find the Titanic. <laughs> if Arden were a robot and also underwater. <laughs> <laughs> Just going for a midnight stroll on uh, the on the Atlantic uh, the Atlantic bottom. Are there separate oceans? Mm -hmm. Well, there's stuff like the Indian Ocean, which is just a chunk of 
Heck, it, like, it's not really anything specific. It's just a part so that, like, on. dips in by okay. India. It's like, ah, the Indian Ocean. Mm. This does not make a pleasing shape. If I outline all of them, it makes this big bump add onto the Pacific. Name it something else. The Atlantic, I think, or the, the Arctic Ocean, I think is the worst. It's just a ring around the Arctic, but it's... There's no defining line as to where it really, I'm sure there is in some chart somewhere, but like, if you were to just travel, there would be no, like, landmark. It'd be like, ah, yes, now we're in the Arctic Ocean. Mm -hmm. 20 feet that way, Pacific or, or Atlantic or wherever. 10 feet that way, the Arctic. Did you catch up with DMS? You need to fucking... Embrace our Lord and Savior, Emmanuel. <laughs> I'm gonna cut off his fucking hand. <laughs> then give me enough time, I'll do it myself. By accident. He's a master. Oh, hi, friend! Yeah, he's bad. That's a bad, bad man right there. Ah, uh, don't look at it. I don't want to look at it. I don't want to look at you. Yeah. Looking at it makes it bad. Also, some of them can see you if you look at them. Oh. Because reasons. Oh, okay, he's still coming for me. Okay, well. I don't want you. I'll close the door on him. Oh, well, I forgot to do that, so. Leave me alone. Leave my robot alone. Yeah, I think he's walking away. Oh, fuck. Never a man should make special armor for one such as he. You bitch! Yeah, no, that, that was the one that made me think of it. Someone's about to say, you bitch. <laughs> of that, that precise line. Yep. Yeah, no, you're a robot. You too. What? Is really she is not. Human. She's a beautiful human rectangular woman. This is, mm -hmm. Everything's fucked. I give up. There's nothing hey, just left. Just look at that fucking down, the the LCD you display. Sure? It sure as hell looks like it. For all I know, there's no one left mm. except for me. Mm. Now, mean, she might be here? a little flat. Don't take this the wrong way. But you know, <laughs> any humans left except for me. everything's good. Have you looked at yourself lately? You're a walking, it works, talking it. diving suit with some electronics slapped on for good measure. I, I don't. You don't want to think about it? We'll start thinking about it. I, I, I don't want to do this anymore. I don't want to be this. I want out. Before you do anything hasty, could you help me with something? What? I was trying to find out what happened with my project when that brute knocked me to the ground. Your project? How could anything possibly matter when you know you're a stupid robot in a stupid dead world? Okay, focus. Oh, I need rude. you to fix me so I can get back to work. Then you can sulk as much as you want. You gotta be kidding, right? I think I have a better chance of building myself a time machine than of putting you back together. I just need to access the computer. Oh, is that an Omnitool you're carrying? Oh, the door opener? I picked it up at Upsilon where I woke up. I don't have to do. Plug it into the terminal. Sure, whatever. You know, when the Omnitool being is very loaded, just plug right my now. Cortex chip into the tool. What's a Cortex mm -hmm. chip? It will be obvious. I'll eject it for you. Just grab the chip and slide it into the Omnitool. Come on, I just need you to do this one thing for me. Sure. Bioware gonna sue somebody? Bioware's gonna sue any somebody? It's Someone make a mediocre RPG? Oh! Uh, it's like, hey, that's my thing. <laughs> Lambda terminal 27 activated. The Omnitool or worse, right did now. someone try and fucking I don't know, remake Ant what an Anthem? Yeah, it into the They're like, Why yeah, we're not going to get you to work on Dragon Age. It's we're going to get you guys to make a third person uh, shooter. Uh, <laughs> Live game. And they're like, right. that's not really in our skill Let's set. Give yeah, gonna need you to do it anyway. Mm -hmm. But can you do it soon? Like, be faster. Mm hmm. Could you do? Could you do it like real quick? 
No. Custom Cortex chip found. Shutting down helper chain. Have a nice day. Whenever the Alex videos are uh, used for you guys. I know Logan's so been weird. back and forth about I'm whether or not enough people are Thanks. really enjoying so them a while what's ago. The project about? My project. It's good that it's helping oh, people well, keep up with uh, I saved all the, people the keynotes of any given session. Into an artificial world. Mm -hmm. We were going to launch it into space to save it from, uh, well, all of this. Intrigued by Are you by telling this me game? that you were going to launch a computer world oh, good. filled with people mm -hmm. into space? As far as horror games yes. go, like... I mean, there, there's some scare, first, but not really, really in the same way, and because it's got this existential yeah, so dread to everything, and now that you know the VR. fucking world, <laughs> yeah, it, uh, yeah. it's a very That's sad me, game. Yeah. This game, mm -hmm. I, I, I stayed up on, fucking at night for like well a couple days, just thinking about this game once I finished it. She could even still be alive. Very good. Weird thought. So the talking robots, are they also scans you did? They could be, but I doubt it. I'd expect much more sense if that was the case. Ah, oh, all right, finally. What's happening? I managed to restore some data from the backup server. This should tell us everything we need. Oh. Could you do me a favor and run into the other room and have a look? I don't seem to be able to view the files in this condition. I need to know that the Ark is safe. Sure, Cap. Thanks, I'll unlock the door for you. Thanks, Cap. What was it you said before? Are you from Toronto? Yeah, I just went in for a brain scan and suddenly here I am. That doesn't make any sense. How? I never got super into Why brain scans. I was one of them that I played for a while. You think that's strange? I know that. It was back in I think it was Dragon Age 2. I was having trouble with a fight. Mm. And then, like, someone came to the door. I left. The AI took over and beat the fight for me. <laughs> that's I'm nice. Fucking furious. <laughs> It's like motherfucker. Like I just got BM'd by the game so badly. <laughs> just like, come on, it's not that hard. I'll do it for you. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, game. I wanted to do that. I didn't even like. It took me to fucking even That's figure out what right. happened because I just Say got something. back and I was in the sure, victory so screen and I was like, "Fuck is this?" I'd really like to know uh, who thought sending Canadian to the bottom nah. of the sea was I, a good I tried idea. playing. Um, let's see. I tried playing Dragon Age Origins. Um, I just didn't. Oh shit! Oh hi! Do it. Careful. Uh. Oh Jesus. Careful. Uh, I'm I'm trying to tell the story, but things are happening around me. Keep your yep. eyes peeled. It's happening. Oh God. Uh, I got lost in this area when I was doing it. Oh Jesus. It's not uh, big. It's just there's an area that's kind of easy to overlook. Mm -hmm. That's one of the side doors in the main hallway that you're uh, this hallway here. Um, I just fucking ignored it over and over and over again, and uh -huh. uh, what happened? Before? And so I was just walking in circles like, that what am I supposed to go? What the hell's happening? Overbearing. Fucking I don't ask Mr. Before. One thing. Uh, Dragon Age. That's bad. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Confusing fucking. Least, I tried playing Dragon Age. I just uh, Origins couldn't get into that. Um. I, th I think it's just kind of like I might have been playing different games at the time and it just got distracted and stopped playing it. Uh, I couldn't get into Dragon mm. Age Origins because I don't know, it just fucking bored me. Um, and then I was talking to my, my friend the other day. He was like, yeah, fucking Dragon Age uh, Inquisition was originally meant to be a, an MMO and they sort of kept the gameplay. I'm like, no wonder I couldn't get into it. If I could, it's an MMO gameplay. <laughs> I don't dislike MMOs, but they need to have something like that can really hook me in, or mm. I need to have good friends playing with me. Because like yeah. Ragnarok, I fucking jammed with Ragnarok for a long time. Yeah, I remember you uh, you saying that. Uh, I think we were talking about it yeah. a little bit ago. I was like a level fucking ninety one Assassin Crossing. I was like getting ready for my second ascension. And I was like. I sung it way too much fucking time in that game. Yeah. Um, the international server still kind of sucks dicks if I ever want to play that again. Like, I saw uh, Jemmy Chu, one of Lily Peachy's friends, was going to open up a private server, and I was like, yo, I'm actually fucking there, though. <laughs> Hell yeah. Like, for real? <laughs> I'd be so about that. Sounds a fucking sick. 
Yeah, as long as there's a strong community, it'd be a blast. Ah, uh, I gotta go further back. Oh, little fucking spoil that for you. Okay. You, did, you did exactly what I did with <laughs> this game. Is you turned left back into the room you went in the first time, and you just gotta stay on this loop. And you're like, "The fuck am I supposed to go?" And she's like, "It's in the next room." You're like, "I'm going to the next room," That's but it's not the one across. It's back. Uh, so that room she's in, you gotta go that way, and then it's like the first thing you right. Yeah, that one. Everything yellow. <laughs> Perfect. Just check the computer. Yes. Yeah, I, I forgot to go this way ever. So I was just running around on the other side like, it's like, what's happening? <laughs> what do you want from me, lady? And she just keeps calling me an idiot while I'm trying to like, figure out what I'm looking for. Opinion poll. Interview number one. Are you excited about the arc? Ah, uh, like when I you join the really arc. See the point mm. of it. But then I thought, why shouldn't we, right? I mean, if we are able to save even just a small piece of ourselves, why wouldn't we do that? So you are in favor of that. Hmm. I think it's really important we do this. Are they talking about putting people in robots? Hmm. What are your thoughts on the Ark? It's a great idea. Finally, we have something to do. Am I right? Are you optimistic about the project's chances of, um, about the Ark reaching space? Yeah, it can definitely be done. You already solved the biggest problem, how to actually get us all in there. Now all we have to do is build the damn thing. And hopefully well, they want to shoot some, some people into space? Yeah, I think we can do it. But it's not going to be easy. Mark, sorry. What are your thoughts on the art project? The idea is uh, just incredible. By every definition. <laughs> it really makes you think about what it means to be human. What makes you say that? Beyond the basics. Beyond the superficial. I'm convinced there's something with even greater value. You have provided a platform. Which is not necessarily restricted to our digital progeny. But a means of actual survival. It's my sincerest belief that we can go on living through the reality of continuity. Hmm. Weird. Is this from inside the Ark? Yes. Praise that's God. The of the world. I want like an MMO that's it's like, um, this place. like Made in Abyss. You can go deeper and deeper into whatever dungeon or anything that's designed around the MMO. Mm -hmm. And oh, getting cool. back out is the hard part. Mm-hmm. Escaping it is the issue. And, uh, just have things in it like at, at certain points that they're not uh like oh i outnumbers you it just is you lose like it is a uh, you run from this it will kill you <laughs> mm -hmm. or like a roguelike mmo where characters Ooh. can die and if they die you start over but have it just be this fucking grand adventure have it be like really fucking hard mm -hmm. oh god how do you f how would you describe your physical condition this is talking about, I guess, me being in a robot. Uh, hmm. Not uh, about being a robot. Not about being a robot. Uh, arc survey. What's the arc? Heck. Uh, uh -huh. I feel fake. How would you describe your mental condition? I feel disconnected, a separation of mind and body. I feel altered, a change in character. I feel lost, I don't exist anymore. I feel normal. How would you describe your senses? As expected. Uh, I feel more sensitive to and aware of my surroundings. Uh, I feel blocked as if my senses are numb. Uh, I'm lacking one or more of my natural senses. That one. Uh, how would you describe the sensation of your new condition? It's pleasant. I was like, I don't like it. Something is wrong. Uh, it's disconceiting. Uh, everything feels constructed. Uh, depressing. I can't shake the feeling of it all being fake. Um, I don't like it. There's uh, no real you... neutral option on that question. Yeah, yeah, not really. Uh, are you troubled by the fact that you are no longer strictly human? Nah, I feel fine. Somewhat, I feel like uh, I lost myself. Like, yes, I mourn my previous existence. 
Like, I don't care what form I take as long as I get to carry on. Uh. It's it's a philosophy? Heck. Six, how do you do, how do you perceive your new existence? It's a direct continuation of my previous self, like a new chapter in my life. It's like being born all over again, a complete do-over. Like it's it's something completely different and it has nothing to do with my pre previous self. Hmm. Fucking none of these are like none of these options are like it's like I don't like it. Sort of things. This um, isn't about like how do you feel about it. This is how um How do you perceive your new st Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh like a new like being born, born all over again, sure. Do you think this new existence will be a life worth living? Yes, as much as of my previous life. Yes, but with less meaning. Uh, maybe we can find a new sense of meaning in this world. Like, now it's too detached from reality and everything I know. Maybe. Uh, would you rather be removed from the project and accept death? That's the first, there's the question. Yeah. <laughs> uh, nah. Your answers have been saved. Thanks. Arc tracker. I found a tracker homed in on the arc. Oh, that's clever. I wonder if I thought of that. Does it still work? It's really not in Venus Mercury. I think so. It's doing something at least. Where is it? Hold on. I'm trying to find it. Please let it be safe. Mmm, closer. Mmm, closer. <laughs> Ooh, oh, that's pretty close. <laughs> Oh boy, it's on or near Earth. That's good. Nope. Boy, oh, it's on Earth. <laughs> Is it in Is Russia? It in... Nope. Is it in the bottom of the ocean? Is it the Caribbean? No. I'm real no. close though. No. It's not no. in Hudson not Bay. <laughs> further away. Not in Chile. Uh, not near Hawaii. Oh, it's uh, near Africa. The Atlantic Ocean, somewhere near Africa. <laughs> okay. Lambda. Nope, it's not over there. Is it near Omicron? Omicron, Percy I 8. Omicron, Percy I 8. <laughs> I am <laughs> Lur. <laughs> Ruler of the planet, Omicron Percy I-8. Uh, <laughs> He's one of my favorite future characters. Mm -hmm. Oh, got it in the first try. As the map aware, we'll have to probably end up I going. It. It's Aspect at a site forest. named Tau. Oh, no, it's on Earth. It's so close to Phi, they almost made it. It's in Tau. Yeah, it won't make it for long <laughs> it's in, in town? that state. A it's in town, and you're in Lambda. It's about as Summer far storm, from you sure. as it can be, at least we in got, terms of this base. Could, Fuck. Could we get on the Ark? I suppose, but I'm not exactly flexible at the moment. Uh, okay. I'll take us there. I can move, jump, swim, sort of. <laughs> you're stuck in the door opener, the Omni tool. I'll just carry you there, and you'll show me what to do. That sounds really risky. Besides, I don't like the idea of you carrying me around. Come on, this is what you wanted to do. Your final mission. I just love how stupid Simon is sometimes. He refers to the fucking Omni tool as the door opener. Yeah. He's call it an Omni tool. He's like, no, I'm not internalizing that terminology. It's a door opener. It opens doors. Look around. What else is there to do? Maybe there's still a working shuttle train that could take us to Theta. I doubt it. Just have a look around. Push comes to shove, I'll walk there. Okay then, I'll just eject from this thing. Don't forget to take me with you. I won't forget. Don't forget. I need health, so I'm not gonna poke it. Hmm. Do I have Don't to go forget back to and take get her? Along. Yeah. Go go back and grab her. Give her a grab. Wait. Where do I go? You gotta go back to her? Right. Uh, nope. Wrong way. There we go. Oh. There you go. Can I pull the Omni tool out? Wait, wait, wait. Okay, just be sure to plug me in again at some point. You got it. Good luck, Simon. Hmm. 
Hmm. She's in my Pokedex now. Use the Cortex chip. And it gets a cool visual upgrade. Hooray! <laughs> oh. Now it's time to not die. Here I go. Not dying. <laughs> Uh, oops, sort of. Remember when uh, Chase and them were asking me about spooky games and fun ones to play, and I, I recommended this one to them, and like it wasn't spooky enough because they wanted like ah spooky. Oh, okay. okay. And so when they got into, it, they were like, ah, it didn't make us too scared. I'm like, were you were you really thinking about the implications of everything going on? Because mm -hmm. it's horrifying. What do you mean? Were you really playing the game? Um. Yeah, they probably should have gone for something like a machine for pigs or uh, mm. dark descent. Yeah. What's in here? Oh. A little bub marine. Yeah. Uh, what Whoever was, was in this? it died. Curie Emergency Vessel 4. Hey, Simon, can you hear me? I hear you. Can you get this thing running? Hang on, I'll give it a try. <laughs> Are we doing it? Doesn't sound like we're Sorry, doing it. Sorry, it's dead. Fuck! <laughs> Where's the shot? The CV came from Curie. It was a ship that used to make runs between Lambda and Lisbon. Looks like their wreck is close. <laughs> Maybe you can find a vessel like this one inside. Just turn the audio up for a second and see this quiet, like, echo of your... Fuck! <laughs> you get around. Great. Right, well, LS is a good game to shriek at. Mm -hmm. That's definitely the, the genre of game that they wanted. Mm. Oh, well. Horror for horror's sake, which is good. I actually like the Outlast games. Mm -hmm. They're a little campy, but sometimes that's what you need. Outlast 2 is actually really fucking good. I've heard. I like heard. 2 more than 1. If you, if you like horror games, those are some good ones. Yeah, although I can't like just random penises everywhere. Or just be oh, naked and just stand there letting it dangle while they stare at you like, ooh, I'm gonna eat you. Mm -hmm. I'm like, please don't. They're like, nah. -uh. But until then, I'm gonna stand here on the opposite side of this metal grate and breathe heavily. Okay. And also one of those, like, it, it is so deep in that genre of horror that anyone who's really savvy with it can just call what's gonna happen oh, at any point. Monster! Monster! It's There's a monster. monster! You have to get away from the monster! I did it! I did the, I got away from the it's monster! Oh! Okay, hopefully it's gone. gone now. What? He's probably gone now, you should go check. Yes, yes I will go check now. <laughs> Your robots can't kill you because you're so scared? Honestly, this game is a good kind of horror, even if you are in safe mode. Like, I, I still prefer playing on normal because I like having that aspect of the gameplay to it. Mm -hmm. Having those little sections of stealth or, you know, escape makes their... It, the, it translates better the tension that the character is feeling to you, uh, to you through gameplay rather than, um, you know, you actually can't really get into Simon's thought pattern, especially because mm -hmm. he's a doofus. Um, yep. So instead you can communicate those emotions in other ways and the the especially in the chase scenes that shit is uh fucking just so this is the boat <laughs> this is the oh god uh we've got like 15 minutes left so <laughs> head, Aaron. oh dang are we underwater y'all we're deep underwater we're very deep underwater we're deep enough underwater that if you didn't have a reinforced dive suit, you'd fucking probably die. Probably. Not um, that it matters for us. Yeah, not really. I mean, no, it's really fortunate we have this reinforced dive suit that just appeared on us. Yeah. Yeah, no, we're we're still a human. We're still a human. Not like our friend. <laughs> hmm? She's a she's a super robot. Oh yeah, she's a super robot. <laughs> She's so robot. Mm-hmm. 
Not like us. Blair Witch. I've some good stuff with Blair Witch. It's uh, it's all right. For for its price tag, super worth it. What is? The Blair Witch. Oh, the the I mean, game. The man of the game. Yeah, I seen. Uh, I, I think wasn't that great. I didn't, I didn't finish it. I was watching someone play it. It's not. It's not gonna fucking like change the way you think or really wow you in terms of horror, but it's it's fairly well designed like visually it's pretty mm -hmm. um and uh thematically it's it's also trying to buy off of the hype of the blair witch mm. which doesn't always work uh because honestly you the movie itself also isn't really that good um <laughs> it's fine like and at the time when it came out because it came out when i was really young uh, it was all the shit because it was one of the first movies to pull the fucking based on a true story bullshit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and everyone believed it. Everyone's like, "This is this footage is real, you guys. These people fucking died." And uh, so a lot of adults tricked themselves into being scared of it. Um, so it did some cool stuff for uh, a relatively low budget film, Spooky Monster, yeah. um, and. Uh, uh, the game, all right. It's got the cool dog mechanic, I guess. And, um, you know, ooh, you might be crazy, but eh. it's it's like 20 bucks. And for 20 bucks for what is a eight hour kind of spooky experience, if you're looking for a horror stream, it's not a bad way to go. But there are better games if out it, there. If it was full price, then fuck that. But yeah, no, yeah, I don't think it's like a, a $60 game or anything like that. <gasps> I saw a shark. Hi, shark. Hello, friend. There's a fear? Yeah, I got that shit for free. That was great. The fuck? There's a fear is also a game that, depending on how much a person likes horror, is worth multiple playthroughs because it has multiple endings. Oh, and they're neat. actually, like, fucking difficult to get because the choices you make aren't as direct. They're, they're a lot more subtle. Where the hell am I supposed to go? Go to the boat. Go to the boat. No. Hello. I don't think I'm going the right way. Hmm. It's all the big structure, you're right. Oh, I think I found Some it. Wrong, there we go. Baby. The Slenderman games? I don't like those games. Mostly because they ruined Slenderman. <laughs> oh. The games themselves are fine. They're really simple. They they had a cult following. They obviously inspired a lot from people like Mark Wire and PewDiePie. Um, but they made Slenderman really accessible to children. Uh, which made media about Slenderman a lot more like of an enticing idea for people and so they tried to codify what up until then is just a cryptid where there's no there's no real lore other than based on the branch man fucking tall people disappear around them probably kidnaps kids that's all we know about Slenderman up until then and then they made a movie which we watched for the memes um it's very funny uh, a couple of okay moments. Honestly, it's better than I got credit for, but it's not great. Like, it's still, it's not good. It's just better than I expected. Yeah. Um, and, uh, yeah, uh, it, 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 it definitely made Slenderman less fun for me. Mm. Also, when people started referring to Slenderman as Slender, <laughs> just Slender, because the game was called Slender the Eight Pages. Oh, that, that, uh, my inner fucking dweeb just wanted to start, like, open palm slapping motherfuckers. <laughs> what bang You address Thunder Man with respect. <laughs> oh, shit. Yanks monster is here. There is monster in here. Hmm. 
Oh, yep, yeah, that guy is uh, not great to look at. I don't fully agree, Goblin. I think some kids can deal with horror better than others. I think it's about what what they're given access to and when. But like most things, most parents don't really know how to police what their kids are viewing. And so they just kind of let them go buck wild. Mm -hmm. I also had the reverse done to me. I watched like Goosebumps when I was a kid, but they also had me on Dextrin, I think at the time, which is basically like speed for kids with ADD. And uh, yeah, that shit fucking murked me. So mm -hmm. I was terrified of everything as having nightmares. Uh, and I just couldn't so the, anything remotely scary I wasn't allowed to watch my family just had me clean off of any sort of horror or fear and that made me really susceptible to it when I actually did engage with it mm -hmm. uh, so I, I ended up again I kind of went into horror games as exposure therapy because I was like I need I need to understand this because I've never been allowed to engage with it in a healthy way oh wow oh fuck Oh, hi, friend. Who teleport? He can teleport? Shit. Yeah. I'm a bird. I'm I don't like it. Like groups of feet at a time. Oh, yep. There he is. Just understanding, you know, maybe your eight year old shouldn't be playing Dead Space. <laughs> maybe not. I mean, it's also that that breaks up the conversation of in uh, North America, anyways. Fucking about uh, how we're way cooler with kids being exposed to really graphic violence than we are about like them seeing a titty. Yeah. I don't even care. Just titty in general. <laughs> they have a fairly like tame amount of nudity in a game, and people be like, needs to be rated adult only. Oh, you're fucked. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I heard it. Yep, he was on something awful is where the original Slenderman meme came from. So yeah, if he catches you again while your screen's like this, then you're actually dead. And you get to load a checkpoint. Mm. It sucks because yeah, you're limping like this. So an enemy at one point got me and <laughs> it, it for some reason it bugged and couldn't kill me, but it kept me limping. Uh-huh. Uh, and so it kept just catching me over and over and over again. Oh, no. <laughs> Until it became not scary at all and was just annoying. <laughs> it's like, stop it. Go away. Oh, oh come on. Leave me alone. I closed doors on him, I think. Can't at least that helps. One. I can't close that one. Yeah, keep running. Eh. Leave me alone. You can also, while he's chasing you, you can juke him because he's not super fast. Like like a lot of enemies are fast when I'm in this. Uh, as long as it's not a straight shot. I think if it's a straight shot, they'll catch him. You. you can like juke into doorways and around stuff and he'll lose you real quick. That's good. Good to know. I don't know where to go though. Uh, he's guarding it. You have to go past him. Hi, friend. Oh, yeah, he's in your way. Oh yeah, so don't look at him. <laughs> Go away. Go away. Yeah, if you look at him, he'll notice him. Yeah. He's one of damn assholes. He's one of them buttheads right there. Ah. Uh -huh. Heck. Uh. All right. Oh, there he is. Oh, God damn it. Go away. Now you can probably sprint past him. He's to your right, so you can just ah, go shit. right there. <laughs> That's the wrong way.
Leave me alone! I'm going up! I'm going up! <laughs> there we go! <laughs> Leave me alone! <laughs> Leave me alone! Hey! Leave! <laughs> Just climbing the ladder, flipping them off. Yeah. <laughs> you can't climb ladders, fool! Yeah, about that. <laughs> I don't like him. He doesn't really move like normal creatures do. He doesn't need to move at go. all. Your destination? What? Did I get here? Hey, I went past it? Shit. Hmm. There's a little highlighted lit up ramp. Ah, that's true. Yeah. Here we go. Hmm. There we go. Hooray! Uh, what? Oh, you made it. This is much better. Let's see if we can't get this thing moving. Spencer in the chamber of how the fuck do you get uh, out of here? Uh, wait, what? <laughs> Safety locks are blocking the vessel's release. Are you kidding? How much more of an emergency could this ship be in? It's on the bottom of the sea. Right? Take a look at the engine room and see if you can figure it out. Maybe there's no... Yeah, I mean, the amount of there. parents nowadays there's are like, Oh, my, he wants to play Doom Eternal? Like sure, that's land. fine. The more reason to get huh? going. What? Uh, so, uh, someone's talking about, like, uh, where is Don't it? Leviathan. My days of working in GameStop. I had to do some deep oh, explanations shit. before I got the, oh, really? Hell no, we then. Response from parents. Because, <laughs> you know, know Timmy will be like, mm -hmm, um, I want to play Doom Eternal. It came out. Give me. <laughs> mm hmm. Uh, and then you're like, so what's it about? And you're like, well, uh, the devils killed your bunny. And they're like, oh. No, <laughs> you're like, yeah. So you go <laughs> to hell and you eviscerate them. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Like, no, like with rainbows and stuff. You're like, no, with a glowing sword. Yeah. Uh, and and oh. guns and God damn it, and sir. Blood and death. They're like, oh, is it like you know, is it good for kids? And you're like, I don't know, man. <laughs> what do you think? That's not up to me. <laughs> That's up to you. you that, that that M on the box says probably not. But hey, it's your life. <laughs> your child's life. Should your child be playing Grand Theft Auto? No. Will they? Oh, absolutely. Oh, they sure will. Oh, boy golly, do they wanna. And then they'll steal your credit card oh, so they can buy short cards. Yeah, you want that, right? Oh, look at him. I fucking, I didn't know where he was. <laughs> you can keep him in your periphery, but you look straight at him, and then he just magnetizes to you. He's like, what? He's like, hi, God. friend. Mm. He's also blocking the way you need to go. Yeah, look at all these fucking bullets. Because <laughs> he always does. He always yeah. does, that prick. Here's some dick. You son of a bitch. Oh. You filter it out. Damn, your kid's lying. Yeah. What you can turn hell? that off. There's, there's an option. There's an option, Mom. It's fine. Uh, first horror game I played was Dead Space on the Wii. I will say this. I love the Dead Space series, but fuck them. <laughs> Oh, God damn it, he can open doors. Aaron, Aaron, he can open doors. <laughs> Aaron, Aaron, I'm so scared. <laughs> oh, <that's> Aaron. Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's not much to do now than either run or, uh, <laughs> or hide. Yeah. I don't know where he is. He doesn't make footsteps either. <laughs> yeah, because he doesn't walk. <laughs> yeah, it's awful. I hate it. He's kind of terrible. It, he is. Yeah, he usually hangs out in the bridge. Yeah. All right, I kind of need you to get past the, there. He, there's circular hallways. What you can do, because he's, he's not fast, but yeah. he, he does teleport. Is you can bait him in a direction uh -huh. and then use circular hallways to kind of whoops the doodle him and just run past where he is. Otherwise, you'll just stand still yeah, and be like... like this this seems to be the only entrance to the place. Yeah, to here, but the entire hallway behind you is a giant circle, right? So if you get him to uh, chase you over here, you can run on the circle around him, and then he's chasing you. That's true. Ow. God damn it. Hi there. Ah! <laughs> hey, buddy. Ah! <laughs> hey, come here. Hey. Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> You gotta debate the shit out of him. Ah! Oh wait, wrong way. Ah! 
Yeah, that's gonna happen a lot. <laughs> Where am I going? Ah! Ah! Leave me alone! Leave me alone! All right. So, do you remember the path you took? Uh, sorta. No. Great. <laughs> okay, that's good. <laughs> that was not good. That's great. <laughs> that was fantastic. I love it. <laughs> that's amazing. That's amazing. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> Hashtag fuckboy noises. <laughs> <laughs> Give me your juicy, juicy health, you weird sponge. Good old underwater electronic buttholes. Mm-mm, good. I think, like, 90% of my shuttles when I was playing this game was just fist and more buttholes. <laughs> I'm not sure how I didn't get banned. <laughs> or at least, like, uh, Aaron, can you fucking calm down? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it is, it is 10 o'clock though. So, and I feel like that's probably a good like checkpoint. So. I suppose you're the that. hardest section of the game. Oh, uh, fuck. How close am I to finishing the harder section of the game? Oh, uh, you got to go upstairs and rip some things out and then you got to get away. Ah, <laughs> uh, gross. But yeah. Yeah, there's a contusion. Once you pull the thing out, he's like, oh, die though. Mm, I didn't like that, sir. And he Thanks. just kind of knows where you are at that point. It's not a hide. It's a, no, he's chasing you. Mm-hmm. Ah, heck. And well. The joke about, do you remember how you got up here? Yeah. <laughs> uh, we might come back to this, um, but assuming Carrie's be uh, feeling better next week, we might go back to Pokemon. Who knows what happens? Who knows what'll happen, really? We see Shal who kills the most. Yeah. Uh... <laughs> But yeah. It's an episode six reference? I can't remember. It's a long time ago. Uh, That's season one Bleacher Bridged BS right there. Oh my god. I still haven't watched Bleacher Bridge. That like was when stuff. Logan wasn't Ishida. <laughs> oh my god. Crazy. Hadn't recast 90% of the cast. Oh. <laughs> uh, okay. I'm gonna hit the stop recording button and then we're Goodbye. gonna stop recording. <laughs> Goodbye, YouTube. We'll see you next time. Goodbye. Bye.